What would I do if I... What up, y'all? Any video here, I'm here with the champ, Gary Russell Jr., WBC featherweight champion of the world. What's going on, big homie? Man, we're putting the last couple of hours mm -hmm. of extremely hard training camp. Mm -hmm. Um, we always grind. I'm one of them fighters that goes into a fight or don't go into a fight questioning, wondering if I could have pushed harder in the gym. Did I cut corners? I'm grinding all the way through. We ready, man. Yeah, I feel you, I feel you. I've seen some of the stuff you've been doing with Coach Calvin. How has that helped you out? It definitely played a big, uh, a big part. You know, everything that we do, um, it's beneficial to us. You know, I appreciate everything that he's done, you know, and vice versa. So it's definitely been a, a contributor, attribute to, to our game. What does it feel like to have your younger brother, you know, fight on the undercard right before you fight, though? What's that experience going to be like? Man, that's sweet. Yeah. I'm going to be working this corner. Yeah. <laughs> I'm working this corner and everything before my fight. Like, we all the way real. We're not fabricated, you know. I ain't nothing watered down when it comes to us. Um... But nah, it's cool that my little brother's gonna be competing on his undercard, man. It's I can't wait for my younger brother Antoine, yeah. after he get off the Olympic team, to actually be able to compete on one of the cards with me and my brother Antonio. You know, so that'll be a tremendous thing to do all in one night. Yeah, that'll be history. That'll be the first time brothers all fought on the same card together. Yeah, three brothers, man. Yeah. We call it the Russell Show. Yeah, that's what's up, man. Yo, any uh. Any, um, what's next for you? I mean, I know you take your one fight at a time, but, you know, what's the future look like for you, though? Well, we got to get past Saturday. That's true. Um, yeah. We get past Saturday. We're looking at collecting all our belts in the division. You know, uh, Lee Selby. Uh, uh, what's the guy? Um, Leo Santa Cruz. Mm -hmm. And that's not to get the mention on Machinko. You got to see me again, man. I understand. What what advice would you give to some young boxers out there trying to come up? I know you you know you achieved championship status, but what advice would you give to them since we're here at the Hartford Boxing Club? Don't cut corners. Yeah. Give it 110 percent. You know that's what makes the difference. Don't wait for your coach to tell you to go and do something. If it's something that you're really driven to do, your parents don't got to tell you to go outside and go play. So shit, nobody have to say to go out there and put the work and the effort in if you really want to be good at it. Yeah. Got to make the sacrifices. There you go, man. The champ, Gary Russell Jr., fighting at Foxwoods this weekend. Shout out to my man, Coach Calvin. Hartford Boxing Club is going down. Check it out. It's going to be on TV. Gary Russell Jr., the champ, right here at Hartford, coming to you live.